Hi. Now somebody wanted to know if they imported an SVG, how they could cut it out as a solid image. So what I'm going to show you is I uploaded an SVG into my uploads. Now when I uploaded the image, uh, uh, I upload quite a lot of images as you can see. And so now I have to go view all. Now it's gone to the screen where you see all your images now and I have to scroll down and it's the Aotearoa image. Now if I click on that I uploaded it as an SVG but when it comes in as you'll see it comes in as a cut file but what it will do is it will cut the inside line and it will cut the outside line so you will just have an outside of this image and Aotearoa will cut out. Now if you want a solid image for your North and South Island and your little Stuart Island down the bottom what you need to do is you need to go over to the bottom on the right and go contour and the contour will come up now if the picture doesn't show on here go to this piece down the bottom where it says a percentage and sometimes you'll find that it comes in at about 300 percent so you can just work your percentages down here so that it makes it easier to see what you you're going at now, as you can see over here, it's got two South Islands and two North Islands, and then it goes into the, um, the letters. So, if we make it a little bit larger so that I can see it, you will now see that there's a line in the middle and a line around the outside. Now, if I click in the middle of that, I should take that image out. So, that's hopefully this one over here. I'm going to click in the middle of this one. Now I can either click in the middle here and on the line or I can click over this side. So if we go down to the little one that's at the bottom, hang on, this one here, I'm not sure which one it is. So I'll click in the bottom of there and I'll go down and this was the image that is in the bottom. Now all I have to do now is go to the X and exit out of there I've now got a solid image that it will just cut the outside one off. Now you could have picked the inside image and had it a little smaller. You can also pick the inside image if you want to layer it. So if you go up to duplicate, and yes it's going to duplicate for us, and then I go back to this, you will see that these ones are still here. Excuse me, there is a message for so, sorry about that. So we're going to change them around this time and we're going to go to here and we're going to click on this little one in the middle and hopefully the one on the outside will disappear. Do the same thing again. Now this image is the smaller image from the inside. So instead of putting that in black I'm going to put it in yellow and then I'm going to put it over the top of this image. Now that's something that quite often people will actually like to have. You can see that there is just a fraction of the Aotearoa around the outside there but that is something that looks quite good. It will take a little bit of working out to put that together but it will be, that would look absolutely amazing again by using both of those. And that's by using the contour button. So don't forget you've got a contour button in there and that you can do that.